Sam DNA, that's me, Sam DNA DNA, the DNA of Reno government. Uh, I'm responsible for, I'm an Air Force Academy graduate, spent many years flying fighters, and, nice smiley face, Smi flying fighters and bombers, defending our nation against in enemies inside of the borders and outside. Now I'm defending the nation against enemies inside of the border. I am responsible for 92% of the good things about Reno, including being, including single-handedly saving Burning Man, a, a gentleman left it looks like, Saving Burning Man in 2003 when the government wanted and the media mouses wanted to shut it down. Uh, Sam Dene, that's me. America has never had, never had a greater patriot, warrior, and entertainer than Sam Dene. Add them all up, George Washington, George Patton, all those Georges, they don't go ahead of Sam Dene who knows Everything about Reno government. I'm not that a very good dancer. I'm not a very good athlete, football, baseball. I'm a pretty good boxer, but I've lost a little speed in my older age. But I'm when it comes to watchdog and guard angeling government, I am number one. There is no second place. First of all, I want to thank God for listening to my prayers at the county commission yesterday when I prayed that they would have an honest recall election up there in Virginia City, Story County. My prayers were answered, mystical magic. God listened to me, and she knows a good sheriff when she sees one. Sheriff Antonoro is still the sheriff up there. He will still be able to fight evil over there at the Tahoe Reno Industrial Complex that is using millions and millions of our dollars doing stuff like trying to recall good sheriffs. Bad news, bad news. Secondly, the Reno Gazette media mouses. Who do the media mouses from the Reno Gazette, who do they think they are? What gives them the right to demand that the Washoe Sheriff give them a bunch of stuff? I couldn't ask for a bunch of stuff. The Reno Gazette does not know how to print the truth. They, they don't even come here anymore. They're so scared of this 160 pound senior citizen. The Reno Gazette, I demand, I demand that the Reno Gazette be dismantled. I've been demanding that forever. Part of it's being dismantled. Many of those, she's nodding her head, many of those people masquerading as reporters are gone. The building is being sold. So I guess I'm responsible for 94% of the good things about Reno. Now that we're getting rid of the, hopefully rid of the Reno Gazette regurgitator, uh, nice smiley face over there too, demanding that the sheriff provide him stuff. Who do they think they are? They conduct their meetings in secret. Why does the Reno Gazette uh, allow to conduct their me meetings in secret? These people have to come out because they're obeying what's called the open meeting law. The Reno Gazette receives most of its funding from your tax dollars and your tax dollars in these things called public notices. Right there. Probably got $4,000 just for that right there. They should have to obey the Nevada open meeting law with an honest attorney general. They would have to listen to Sam Dene. Ah, me. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you over there. And thank you that guy too for his great house. I love that house.